Oh my god, my voice has gone kind of weird. <coughs> I'm literally just getting up, that's why. Let me try that again. Good morning, everyone. Hope you're all doing well. Today, I woke up expecting it to be like nearly 10 or something. I felt like I'd had a really good line. And I looked at the clock and it was 8.40. And I was like, is it still really that early? Although now it's like nearly 9, I think. I think. Yeah, it was exactly 9 o'clock now. Um, I'm pretty much just still getting up. My voice has gone a bit croaky. I think that's because I've literally just got up though and haven't had like, as it is still a bit dry and sore and I haven't had like anything to drink or eat yet. So it's still a bit tense. Um, also because my nose is still kind of like blocked right now. That's like my major problem. So I'm having to, you know, when you're asleep and your nose is blocked, so you end up breathing through your mouth more. So it makes your throat all dry. That's like my current problem. I'm just looking out and it looks like it's going to be such a nice day today. The sky's like completely clear and blue and the sun's coming through. So I'm hoping... That means that it's going to be a little bit warmer as well. I'm about to head down now, get my breakfast. I'm really craving some chocolate banana porridge, which I'm going to make with cacao powder and then banana, almond milk and oats. Because I've been wanting that the last couple of days, but we ran out of bananas. My parents went and did a food shop yesterday though, which means we've now got more bananas, which is good. So I can actually go and make that. What a lovely greeting, Bob. So he, he, oh, what can you smell? Can you smell? Where's Bailey? Oh, you're sat here. Are you wrecking this new toy? Are you wrecking the new toy, Bailey? You're a monkey. You always destroy the new toys, doesn't he, Bobs? Aww. I finally got around to changing the clock in my... The clock in my battery? The battery in my clock, so it's actually finally the right time now. I really want to make some blueberry chai jam for... Well, there's pancake day coming up. So... Oh my god, we've got so many blueberries in the I've just seen there's an old packet here. I might throw these ones away, they've got a bit here. And then we've got two new giant packets like this. Sorry, my mum's currently with the Hoover, that's what the banging is all about. And then yeah, we've got another one like this. Okay, we've overbought blueberries, but I'm not complaining, I do like a good blueberry. Yeah, I think I'll get rid of these ones, which we've had a little while, so I start to shrivel up a bit now and use like the fresh new ones. I might as well, rather than just using up those ones. And, yeah, I really want to make some blueberry chai jam because with pancake day coming up, I'm thinking blueberry chai jam could be something really nice on a pancake. So, I'm going to make that now so I've got it prepared, ready. All I'm literally going to do is use two cups of blueberries and a tablespoon of chia seeds. And that is it. I'm just going to blend up the two cups of blueberries in a... Um, food processor like a blender when we use the Nutribullet just to blend these up and like get the juices out and stuff and then mix in a tablespoon of chai seeds I'm not I've kind of made this before because when I have overnight oats sometimes I'll make like a sort of blueberry chai jam to go on top and I just mash up a few blueberries in a bowl with a fork and then add in chai seeds but yeah this day I'm just gonna use a blender so that it really gets like all the juices out and stuff <laughs> simple you could also add a sweetener like maple syrup or something to it as well but I'm gonna leave it for the moment and then try it when I have it with like my pancakes on pancake day and then add like maple syrup or whatever to the pancakes if I want it a little bit sweeter so I've just put it in the fridge for the moment to set I would say that I wish I'd blended the blueberries slightly less I prefer it when there's still like chunks of blueberry in there I did over blend slightly so that's the nice thing when you mash it with a fork but it just takes so much more effort um, you like get still pieces of the blueberry in there and, like the blueberry skin and then when the chaya jam sets it like gives it such a good texture because it has like chunky bits of blueberry in there still so i feel like that one's gonna be a little bit thin for the texture but hopefully it will still taste good all the same and hopefully it will set nicely but yeah also in the end by the way i ended up using 150 grams of blueberries which is around one cup because two cups was going to be quite a lot and I don't want to make too much of it because I don't know how often I'll be having it 
and it's the first time I've made it so I don't want to make like a massive batch and then not end up using it so yeah I just went with one cup of blueberries or 150 grams of blueberries and then um one tablespoon of chia seeds i was just recording a voiceover for one of my videos and i go to my mom okay i'm just gonna go upstairs and record a voiceover her like take on that is like okay let's make as much noise as possible starts clattering around in the kitchen moving furniture about i'm like you don't really understand the concept do you i just tried out the new nyx three and one brow pencil that i bought yesterday and like in terms of if i like it or not i like the pencil bit and I like, like the powder bit's okay, I don't know how I feel about it or not, but the mascara bit just kind of goes a bit everywhere and gets a bit messy. So I'd leave that bit, but the pencil and the powder I will use. I've also put on my Kylie lip kit in the shade Ginger, I was really, really feeling like wearing that today. And I'm finally actually dressed and more or less ready, I just need to brush and straighten my hair quickly, but I mean it's, it's just a quick straighten to get rid of any like kinks and stuff in it. And it's 20 to 2 and I'm finally dressed and makeup done, which is great. We're about to head out for lunch as well and it's just such a lovely day. Like it's going to be so nice heading out along the seafront to get some food and have a nice roast dinner, which is what like makes a Sunday a Sunday. You need to have a roast dinner. So I just need to quickly sort my hair out and then I should be ready. I've also got my new top on that I bought from Bershka yesterday. I realised it's not mirror writing, it's such kind of mirror, it still didn't make sense. It's actually just upside down. Took me a second to realise that, but yeah, got this on. I was gonna wear my new jumper as well, but it didn't quite like go with this top because this top like overhung the from the top of the jumper, so it didn't look quite right. <laughs> Our roast food has just arrived. I've got my roast chicken today. We've got plenty of carrots, potatoes, and cabbage as well. And both parents come for the lamb. Looks good. It's literally packed along the seafront. I don't think everyone else has had the same idea just because it's such a nice day. I just can't get over how nice this weather is now. And it's actually like so warm in the sun after just having such a like run of really bad weather over the last few weeks and month really it's been so bad but oh, i just can't get enough of this i'm really hoping it's gonna stay like this although next like sunday monday they're forecasting rain again i'm like no keep the sunny weather it needs to stay now it literally feels like a spring day today got the two little puppies out here with me too enjoy enjoying the sun although actually to be fair they're just sitting chewing on some treat my dad's given them but it's just honestly so nice like can it please just stay like this the button on my trousers here this button is like metal and from sitting in the sun it's genuinely gone like so hot that i actually like burnt myself when i just touched it i'm pretty happy with how my jam already is looking the jam that i made earlier it's set quite well and it looks pretty tasty and it also smells really nice from the blueberries i'm gonna get pulled off the chair <laughs> oh, oh, you want it? <laughs> Bring it back. Good boy. Good boy. Oh! If you drop it, I can throw it. <laughs> it's hurting my hand, Bobs. I'm getting rope burn. just been sat doing quite a bit of my puzzle. I feel like I've been making fairly good progress. So over here, okay, a lot of ooh, that bit's coming out. Hang on, let's just pop that back in. It doesn't want to go back in. Oh, there we go. So that bit over there's coming along. I've got along the front here, I've got quite a bit of the giraffe done. And over here I've got the ears of the rhino done. And then the zebra and then the bird as well is looking quite good now. So like along this area, it's coming along quite well. Along the bottom, not much has really happened at all, to be honest, but it's slowly getting there, but I think I'm going to leave it there for now. Also watching Dancing on Ice as well while doing it, that's what you can hear in the background, but yeah, it's still coming. Oh yeah, I've also done quite a bit of the tiger too. I've pretty much got myself ready for bed now. I'm going to get to sleep in a sec. It's 10 now. I'm going to get like a fairly early night. Try to get a fairly early night. I'll say that now. See if I actually get to bed like early or not. Because yeah, it's Monday tomorrow. want to have a nice early night. Get up early tomorrow. Have a good start to the week. Probably go to the gym. 
and yeah just get a good start god this lighting is really not great every time i like start the vlog over here i'm like this lighting really does not do any favors at all but i hope you've had a good start to the week and had a good monday also my new main channel video went up yesterday for you watching this it'll be linked down below as my previous video would be great if you could head over to my main channel check out that video it's a baking video which i haven't done for a little while and i'm so happy with the end result so please go over and check that out and yeah that is basically everything that's happening today i've just been chilling watching yeah i was watching dancing on ice and then now i've just been watching a bit of youtube and yeah i'm gonna get to sleep so i hope you enjoyed today's vlog smash the thumbs up if you did click the red subscribe button down below if you're new and i will see you tomorrow with a brand new vlog night